me. You're finished! You're finished, apostate prophet! As soon as we get power over you, we will chop your head off and we will parade your head through the streets so that everyone else takes takes notice and sees what we do to people like you! We're coming for you! We're coming for you! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone who's watching goes, huh, if one of these guys ever messes with me, <laughs> I know exactly what to do now. Guys, you got chip, 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 <laughs> what? You had him on your program and, and actually asked him questions about his methodology? How dare you? <laughs> You're finished! You're finished, boy! You're <laughs> finished, boy. <laughs> Holes in the narrative. Narrative, narrative, narrative. <laughs> <laughs> finally, finally the Christians are condemning him. <laughs> <laughs> now I've got, now I've got him. Allah prays for Muhammad, not to Muhammad. And the crowd burst into cheers. Yay, our God prays. Our, that, he could have said anything and they would have cheered. Like, he could have stood up there and goes, bibbidi bobbidi hello bobbidi boobidi that's the refutation. And they would have cheered like mad, right? Yeah. It's, Allah it, it, Allahu Akbar. Oh, so brilliant, right? <laughs> what can I do? Hey, can you get him to agree to this? Can you get him to agree to all these rules that I will then break because I don't have to follow them? Oh, hey, guys, can you trick him into coming on, making making uh, the apostate prophet think it's just a discussion, and then I come in here, ha ha! Can we do that, right? <laughs> a, a really confident individual does not need to do that, right? Someone who's deeply insecure needs to do that. And oh, I will destroy you all. Oh, I'll take everyone on. And as soon as you, okay, let's go. It's, oh, will you condemn him? Oh, Patreon, will, <laughs> will you come to my rescue? YouTube, will you come to my, will anyone help me, right? I'll fight you. I'll fight you all. <laughs> and as soon as you say, <laughs> As soon as someone says, okay, let's go, oh, no, who's going to rescue me from this guy? Will, will you help me? Will you help me? No one's helping me. I don't know what to do now. Me strong, me hijab. Slim. Adam. This is Muhammad Hijab. Huh? I have a plot. Allah's the best of plotters. <laughs> invite him, yes, invite him on. But then, hey, I come out after 10 minutes. Ha ha! It's me, Muhammad Hijab. Me strong. Patreon, can we get them banned? Okay, if you agree not to tell him, since I know that you will keep your word, David, then you must have me over to your house. And when you're starting a random live stream with the apostate prophet, <laughs> I will jump out. Ha ha! I'm ready for our debate. Ha ha! And it's, a ha! it's because you fear the power of Islam. Michael Coyne says, how is it that David is chilled? And he is or was a psychopath. I don't mean to be negative. And Muhammad Hijab is less controlled. Michael Coyne. Different. I don't think you know what psychopaths are. <laughs> psychopaths <laughs> are very, very calm. Um, you can, if you, you could do horrible things to a psychopath. He won't, uh, he won't lash back out. He will start plotting, right? Um, the, you might be thinking of sociopaths. Sociopaths tend to be hotheads. And, and that's the classic phrase. Um, hot-headed sociopath, cold-blooded psychopath. Um, so psychopaths are notoriously unemotional. Um, that, no, they can have, you know, they can be greedy and they can be violent and things like that, but they do not react much when, if you try to, to provoke them. And if they do, if they do show a reaction, it's because they did a quick calculation on what is the best way to react, right? So in other words, if you ever see me flipping out, I can't believe you! That's because I that's because I thought to myself, this is the appropriate uh, image to project to this person right now, right? Because there, there, are, there are situations where it's best to be as enraged as possible, right? If you, if you were cornered by five guys and they were about to beat you to death, 
it's in your best interest to be just to flip out and be in, as enraged and go into a berserker frenzy or something like that, right? So you can actually calculate that stuff. But um, yeah, uh, uh, Muhammad Hijab is an insecure, uh, borderline narcissistic person with some serious issues. You, you, so and that's why I told him, remember when we started talking about this, when he started talking about everyone's wives, we were on a live stream and I said, you do, I, how many times did I tell him? Like 30? Dude, you do not want to go this route. You are not made for this. I said, you're not made for this. Your ideology is not made for this. You're easily provoked. This is not the route you want to go. And of course, <laughs> yeah, we see once again, D. Wood Wright. Let me go get other people to condemn you. William Lane Craig, will you condemn him? Hey, Christians, will you condemn him? He starts going that route. That doesn't yeah. work. Oh, let me get them canceled from Patreon. Oh, everyone, flag their account. Oh, right? We're going to... We're gonna all go to Patreon. We're gonna make Patreon accounts, and we're gonna go to their go to their pages and complain that this is hate speech. And we're gonna show them the video where they're eating the Quran and where they're ripping up the Quran, and we're gonna get them banned. And this donation brought to you courtesy of Muhammad Hijab. Um, and uh, just just say, hey, this is this is this is all thanks to Hijab. Can you? Their attacks are the are a source of like uh, internal mental and physical energy to go after their ideology. But now they've also expanded into becoming a source of financial, <laughs> financial <laughs> energy for us, right? That now they're, they're funding us. And it's guys, yeah, uh, yeah. he's the one thumping his chest. <laughs> me, me, <laughs> Apost Apostates must die. They're just doing it for money. Ha ha, I take away their money. <laughs> Oops, actually I'll get them way more money. Oh no, what do I do now? Oh, well if that's what would work with you, let me try everything else in the entire world except that. I'm proud of that. We're proud of that. <laughs> Just think about the Quran and the Hadith. You know, fight those who do not believe in Allah. Uh, Muhammad said, I've been commanded to fight people until they say there's no God but Allah. Right? I mean, ordering people to fight and subjugate over their beliefs that's all fine. What about beating your wife? Oh, that's fine. Everything is fine. What about, uh, you know, tearing the Quran? That's a hate crime. They wow. should be banned. Yes, we're going to kill you. We're going to execute you. Yes, we'll destroy you. Ah, ah, we're going to grow and destroy you. Islam, fastest growing religion. They will establish Sharia and then blasphemy laws. Ah, ah, ah. And if you don't want to be <laughs> governed by the teachings of an illiterate seventh century caravan robber who boned a little girl, if you don't want to be governed by that, well, we're going to call you evil Islamophobes. <laughs> it is. uh, apostate prophet, we're going to kill you when we get the chance. We're going to kill you. And Muhammad is like, I'm going after your wives. Uh, golden showers. Golden showers. Oh, uh, uh, your wives. Oh, uh, everyone whores. Oh, uh, uh, whores. Everyone whores. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, and we and, and, and we, we take a, we take a Quran to do something to it for six seconds. And then it's, oh, Patreon, will you help us? Oh, will someone help us? Will you all condemn him? It's like, right, it is a mistake to think, oh, just focus on arguments and having the best arguments. If you're focused on having the best arguments and someone near you focuses on having the biggest mob that can kill you, guess who wins that argument? You know, I will never face you. I will never do it. Whatever. Okay, you're here for an interview. Ha-ha! Ha-ha! Where'd you come from? <laughs> it's a super genius. Brilliant tactician, Mohammed Ajab. I know. Uh, golden showers. Oh, we'll just talk <laughs> about golden showers. Oh, it's not working. Them now calling me Mohammed Golden Showers Hijab. Me no like this. <laughs> uh, me attack the wives. Oh, everyone whore, 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 whore. Right? Oh no, now they no now them eat Quran. Oh, me no me no know what to do. Oh, right, he doesn't know. To do. And, me no strong, David strong. Oh, me no do that. Ah, oh. <laughs> we've got him. Now we can ignore all of his refutations of Islam because we can attack him for this. Ha ha, me strong. <laughs> I'm sure we'll be talking a little bit about Muhammad Hijab, a little bit about, a little bit about Ali Dawa, a little bit of this. Gonna have a little bit of this. <laughs> Becoming a lot of this. Until Muhammad Hijab decides to be a good Muslim and take down some tweets.